Hello, welcome back everyone for the second draft. Sam Ralph from Troy Trader here. From Troll Trader. <laughs> from Troll Trader. <laughs> also with Pete Ward, my... What's up? <laughs> I feel like I'm introducing a video, like a YouTube video, but actually, that is what I'm doing. That is what you're doing. Yeah, exactly. Dude, well, you know what uh, Lewis told me about this card? What? So when you attack with it, yeah. uh, it then looks like the card is like squatting. <laughs> yeah. I looked at it on the side. Yeah, I get that. I get the vibe. That card fits in all the archetypes we like to draft. Exactly. It's not a white card either. There's actually no white cards in this pack apart from Jolly's cooler. It goes in blue black pants. <laughs> <laughs> and it goes in blue red lightning red crew. Yeah, exactly. It does it all. And we stay away from the dinosaur. And yeah, we don't want to fall into a trap of taking the big clunky dinosaurs. Yeah, don't take dinosaurs. Right. Ooh. Well, there's the pants. It's the worst pants though. I think it might be Perilous Voyage. I think. Uh, I like that card. I think in a vacuum, this is better than this, unless you're trying to splash. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. But these aggro decks that we like to draft don't tend to splash, right? Yeah, because you're so low curve and mm. I think you want to splash that much. I don't know any cards you do want to splash. There's, there's a bunch. Really? Think I which? Can think of one. Which one? <laughs> Literally hostage taker. Oh. The first pants. Well, that's the best pants. It is by far jeans. It's just black skinny jeans, you know. That's what it is. Pants with wings. Yeah, pants with wings. Yeah, exactly. I haven't. I got some earrings today with wings on. Uh, well, I can't see a second one. But I can see this card. You think that one's better than Bite Keeper? I think the, so. The yeah. In blue black, I think it is because it does more damage. Yeah, and I mean, I guess if your pants give wings anyway. Yeah, that's the point. It might be this though, because we stay on blue. Really? But then we don't have, because like, black has the best one drops. Cause it has There's DC. also another pair of pants. Ooh, we didn't see those pants. Is, right, that, is that good? Yeah, it's really good. It's yeah. really good on the flyers. If you have lots of these, then black keeps better. We probably, we, I mean, we've got to wear one of those black one drops, right? Exactly. It has to. This will take the uh, the black pants. If we don't wear one of those, we might as well just resign from this draft, right? Yeah, because someone's just stealing our deck. The deck's just not playable if two people are drafting it. Two other people. Oh, this card is a uh, pirate that holds pants. And then the uh, Storm Sculptor. <laughs> we, we fell into a trap of Storm Sculptor last time, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, this card is not very good. We killed Storm Sculptor this time. Yeah, this is Ted, the, uh, the good Dead Eye Tormentor. It's actually just really medium, but it's nothing else that good in the pack. Like, it's probably the best card. Yep. Yeah. I like this card, but it's really bad to keep putting pants on creatures. Yeah. Alright, Sailor remains. Oh, you could take Brazen Buccaneers. It's not bad with the Dead Eye Tormentors, right? Going to discard yeah. again. Yeah. It's probably just Buccaneers so we can stay open on the deck we want. But it could just be this. Like, so. it's going to be kind of easy to pick up a 4 drop if we want one, right? But like, it like, I think this is a better card than Ruse. It keeps us open, but Ruse is much sweeter. I Do you think Shore that. Strike is just a better card? No, I, I think Buccaneers is higher value than Shore okay. Strike. I think Buccaneers is really good. In uh in, in his aggressive decks, I mean like I don't think it's great. Yeah, I've been kind of impressed with it. I think we just take the Buccaneers. But yeah. I really would rather be in blue black than The last haste creature was like the four mana three two, like elemental haste. Which one was that? I don't remember what it was called, but it was like pretty bad. But the Buccaneers has always seems pretty good. Just put mainly because it's a pirate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If this was a real draft I'd probably hate this. Or this. Yeah. Yeah, that's but I think I'd rather have this because it's a lake J Garden, yeah. And we have blue cards to be in Merfolk if we wanted. This pack's just really bad. I take Canopy here. Do you think Raider's Wake is just Stone Cold unplayable? I think so. Might be good though. I've never played it. We could take it and see and find out. I think it's probably better than taking Canopy. Okay. Ooh, that's pretty decent. Yeah, this card's also really late. Yeah. But I don't know how good this card is. Yeah, I guess we get a crash. Ooh, there it is. We wield a uh, one pants holder. That's good. Always like a couple of cat spells on the sideboard, you know. I think we're firmly in. Well. The correct deck, yeah. Pretty, point. pretty sure we're gonna be blue black pants. Pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah, we we have two. There can't be any more of a draft, right? Who are we drafting with? Me. Jad. That's Jad off. Beat us and it's like, oh, I'll just run over the draft. Free rolling. Free rolling. There we go. 
Think Tank DK. Knights. That's a great name. Knight Scorpion. But Holy Piggy. Okay. That smells good. Warlord Margul. And the final. And that's not. W winning. That's winning. A, winning. That's a good name. Oh, that's a good name. That winner. Apart from Cheryl Lane. Um, I don't think that rare is playable. Really? You think so? Mm. You dive down. <laughs> dive down is really good in the pants, though. This pack is just a brick. Rip? <laughs> is this, if we want to be in red. Which we could hedge. Are we going to play dive down? Yeah, definitely. I think, I think pack two, you've got to, got to commit. Got a commitment to dive down. I think so. I think I agree. It's kind of horrible, but you don't want to be flopping around. Yeah, bless me. Bless Rewarded. This is a great removal that spell. Not against the Merfolk State, though. Nope. So we found out in a, in a previous draft. I guess we have to take it. There's a nothing on three in the pack. To note. Ooh, Ooh that's that a nice one. That is good. I've never got to play with this card, so no, I'm really excited. Neither have I. Let's go slam it. There's a. This would like to wheel in this, I guess. <coughs> oh, these are some nice cards, Sam. Is this card good? I think it's pretty good. Yeah, I think so. Do you know you get to choose the cards? Uh, yeah. I never knew that. This and could be good. Uh, from opponent's yeah, I didn't know that. It's not like a Grim Lava Monster. You know, I really do like Grim Lava Monster. You know, I've played so much of that card, I played a Delva deck where I cut. That is pretty good. I played a double deck where I cut um, Delva and just. I think I like this card more than the two drop. I could be wrong though. Yeah, the three drop is definitely better, right? Yeah. Maybe in the pants like, deck it should be like Especially this. because in the pants deck you have a lot of one drops to trigger raid. Yeah. Good point. <laughs> so if you, you don't have to curve two, three. Yeah. yeah, I like that. This draft has been pretty easy. There's not been this a. This draft's been going well. Yeah. We only got one. We, we ran out a little bit below EV on a. Woman wins. I don't know actually. It seems I to be think, he's I think American. We're kind of on EV right now. Like maybe slightly above. I had a deck that had five. Yeah, but one of the wins are quite hard to come by. <sighs> it's like I swear for cheaping to me like the last one I tested for, where in my practice drafts I got like five real forms. It's like the nuts blue red spell stack. And when I got to the GP, I just had like none. Yeah. But maybe because it's an English GP, we can hedge. I'll just take this for the sideboard. I would just be like incredibly happy if I made it to the drafts. To be honest. Have you not day two to limited GP? Well, yeah, but I always feel very lucky if I get if I get to play in the free drafts. It's just it's just so sweet. It's just so fun. It's just great, yeah. Playing day two GP drafts is just it's just insane. There it is. Yeah, I have enjoyed it when I've got to do that. <coughs> we have a strong a strong start here to this draft. Yeah, pack three has to give us some goodies, but you know we'll be we'll be fine. We need some playables, but these are these, these are some solid, good ones. Solid, a lot of cards we've got. Yeah, exactly. That is pretty good. Vanquish? Or Stormfleet? I think it's Stormfleet. Yeah, I'm thinking we take the Stormfleet Aerialist. Like, Vanquish is not really that insane in this kind of deck, right? No. It's pretty good. Like, it's pretty good. It's very good last time. Helps you hedge against combat tricks. Against combat tricks, against things that are just huge roadblocks, like any rich yeah. creature takes out of the game. Yeah, the for free four is really God, good. If that you card. kill a Grazing Whiptail with that, that's upper mana and. Up we but may well wheel a Depths or a yeah. Shaper Apprentice, maybe. I don't want to wheel this. Maybe because the Merfolk deck would take Shaper's, na Shaper's nature. Yeah. So there's a chance. All right. But I, I think guess this card we don't really have that many Merfolks for it. But <coughs> yeah, we have n no Merfolks. One. One, yeah. one Merfolk. Yeah, I can get on board. Aerialist is just insane. I like Water Trap Weaver. It's a card worth money. I think um, it is. You can check on Go Boss. I just don't think it is. No, it's worth half a ticket. No, I'll definitely just take this one. Especially in leagues, it just means taking. Like, in a, in a real drop, it might actually be correct to take this. I don't think so. But, you know. I'm really, really low on, on hate drafting. Really? Yeah. This is why. Like, you literally have to. Play against that first. But first of all, it has to make it into the deck, right? Which obviously it will. Yeah. But then. Maybe we should by the way. Um, it's a one drop. Yeah. We'll probably wheel it. We may wheel that. Like, with 
Let's pick one up here. Another one drop. Boom. Like another one drop. <laughs> I think we need a two drop. Yeah. Well, this car can make our deck. I'm pretty happy with this one. Yeah. Do you think so? No, I'm just kidding. Isn't it like okay in this kind of deck? Aang is okay, but I think we just need more creatures to. Like if it wheels, we might put it in our deck. Yeah. If it wheels, I would put it in my deck. Oh, that's the second one of us. I hate one. Storm Sculptor. I do. Kind of decks. It's at its best in decks with one drops, right? Yeah. But well, could we have like eight creatures? Maybe this is the way we win. Well, last one pants was more nutrition. We have Fourteen creatures. Mm, I just this card is really underperformed in the last draft we played. Yeah, but. And I I think having multiples is just really bad. So just want one. And in the last draft we actually had the we had more one drops. I think. No, we only had two one drops with it. We also had the the waters, the one that makes the token when you make a merfolk. Yeah. So that's why I think I prefer this pick and not playing multiple. Because if you ever draw two, it's just so bad. Uh, that's nuts. It's nuts. Yeah, we have two of these. We have uh, this guy. It's good with the weaver too. The weaver. The tapper. Oh, yeah. The tapper. Ooh, dark nourishment. It's a good finisher. The rare okay. for your count. Ooh, that's pretty good. That's good. That's insane. Yeah, real blight keeper. You're really gonna play all three blight keepers? Maybe. We don't have many pants to put on them. Just two pants. Yeah. But we do have. We don't really have that many flyers, and we do have a storm sculptor. We can work it out in debt build. I think it's probably our last card though. That's pretty pretty late. I'm not really sure. I don't think Blossom Drive's that good. But it's definitely not like fifth, like 14th pick, right? Yeah, I don't think it's great. My deck at the GP, no GP, Nationals had two of them. I, do you still think that deck was pretty good? The Nair deck I played? Yeah, it's like, for what for a, for a dinosaur deck, it's pretty yeah. good quality. Gishath is the best thing you can ramp into. Exactly. I had a great game. It just ends the game instantly. Yeah. If you cast it, which is what you want. I, I was like in a game where I was super behind. I was like, wow, oh, I don't know how I win this game. But I, I drew a, I drew a Gishraf and I cobbled wings in play. I had nine mana, so I got right, equip it. Tap my phone fade. Made two dinosaurs. I was just ahead on board. And they had to dart nourishment. They had, um, because I've made two dinosaurs. I didn't know they had it, but they had two dart nourishments. And they had to cast dart nourishments on my creature instead of just like target me twice. Just a game life. Yeah, so if I didn't draw a Gishraf, I was just dead. But luckily. I'm a lucky boy, and I got to win nationals. So, well, deck. Yeah, <laughs> I think that's fine. You want to check in the sideboard? This card's not great, but yeah, we would have liked more pants, but I think that's always the case. Yeah, we only got to see. We only saw two, and we took both. So, yeah, we saw swashbucklings. So maybe we could have been in red, but nine, seven. But these are the better pants. Yeah. Like, Swashbuckling is the worst pants. Yeah, this is. I feel like we overuse in that term. Pants? Yeah. It's just how you describe the uh, the auras. The auras. It's 9 7 correct. I think it's just be 8 8. Um. Nah. Because we have double black. I guess 9 7 is fine. And we don't have to cast this on 3. Or, like, or this. 10 blue spells. Yeah. And the two of the blue spells loot. But then we have two Dire Fleet Hoarders, which kind of fix. And we want to cast our one drops on one. Yeah. And Walk the Plank double black is, is tough. Oh, it's pretty well. They were in our draft. One draft, yeah. That sounds great. It's a good hand. Yeah. I think we make this on turn three, if it's a, if it's a choice. Probably, yeah. If we even get to turn three. Then we're lucky enough to have drawn land. Ooh. Make this guy. So maybe we get to loot into it. Maybe. No. Lucky boy. This is a bit of a punish, isn't it? I think we still want to attack and make this. Cause then yeah, no, you kind of have to, right? It's yeah. just such a good value. It's just ancestral, really. It's actually kind of fine that we're trading, because we're also taking damage to get value. Yeah. <coughs> I mean, it's just confident. Yeah, I played a. <sighs> That's just the wow. best case. 
that's insane. You can block. Draw some more cards. I should definitely just put a stop my hands down because I draw skull doggery. Yeah. Well, this is going quite well. <laughs> yeah, surprisingly. <laughs> what a great game. What a what is a pretty fun game, isn't it? I don't really get it. Oh wait, because yeah, I'm sitting one with a win. Sense, my but yeah, they get maximum maximally punished for that one. Yeah. Okay. Guess we flicker. Okay. Yeah, I guess we have to. Right? We could just trade. I'm just make trading and making a creature that can't attack ever. It's kind of bad. Yeah. Okay. Like at least a rune raider can send in our dudes for value. I'm in a really good card to have. That would have been a really good card to have. Yeah. It's pretty hard to attack now. Yeah. Hmm. They could have the snapping sail back that we passed. Yeah. But I think we just have to accept that. And if they have it, we just bounce. Yep. We get, we get to draw two yeah. cards, basically. It's really not that bad. Yep. So I don't double block. Uh, this guy. Yep. Yeah, this is these. Yeah. We'll just. So we'll just ancestral. Okay. Yep. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's pretty great. So we attack with this. Wait, we attack with both two. Wait. We could. Which is a pretty sick play where we can attack. Can chomp attack with that. And then make this, bounce this. Yeah, draw loads of cards. Sure. Treasure. This rune raider is just popping off. I so we're still behind, but yeah, I think we're still behind. We're really behind as well. Ow. That is interesting. I guess we're gonna double block. Double block with this and this. Yeah, because then they have to use mana or just trade, and they can't do anything else with their turn. Yep, that sounds good. And I can't really afford to take damage because when we win this game, it's just making enough chompers and getting them with this enough times. I'll just draw in Market of Vampire. Yep. Yeah, see? Got him. Double spell. Okay. Oh no. So their last card is the sail by. Yeah. Don't think we're going to make them discard that one. <laughs> really? You don't think so? That was not a good draw. Maybe we should have made him discard instead of drawing a card. Mm. Cause it confirms our value. Yeah. Kinda of just playing a bit quickly. Which is a bit loose. Oh, trigger resolved? Just say okay. Oh, I thought trigger resolved. Cause it was like sort of pulls for a little bit. Dude, we've drawn so many cards, eventually we have to draw a mark of the vampire. Exactly, we have to. We have drawn like nine we've drawn ten lands and we have sixteen on a deck. That's really tough to make this work. We have to triple block. Alright. And just like allow him to eat. Allow him to do this. That is. It's okay. Probably like this, right? Um, so they have yeah, to put a counter. That's, that's better. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty ugly, but. Yeah. They should buff the flower as well. If we draw a Market of Vampire, we're probably in pretty good shape. If we draw it literally this time, we're in great shape. Yeah. Hmm. Well, Blood Keeper is actually kind of good. Yeah, I guess it's <laughs> actually kind of really good. Yeah. Yeah, it is, isn't it? 
As long as we don't dink the mark of a vampire off the uh, Rune Raider. Is it even that bad? Take four. It would be kind of lame. Mate. I'm pretty sure it's hit land every time. Yeah, it's stuck on. I told you it's. We took four. We took four. Really? From what? The um, interloper? Yeah. Okay. Well, they are playing very badly. <laughs> Yeah, these shavers of nature have really... Should really should be getting in. I don't know why they're not. In, yeah. It's just so bad. Now it's really bad because it means we can jump with Blight Keeper, activate. It's just the best, right? Yeah. It's just the, the, the nuts. Now if we draw Market of Vampire, just die, nearly. That's something. That's a dive down. That is a dive down. Yeah, pretty happy to trade off the rune raider now, I think. They come in with like, multiple creatures. I just wouldn't block. Because then we could just kill him on the next turn, on the backswing. And kill him? Nearly. We've drawn nearly all our lands as well. We're going to put them to four here, essentially, with the blight keeper and the unblockable creature. Yeah. What can we draw that kills him? Anything? Oh, I like this attack. Well, I guess our opponent can double pump, then double pump, and they're gonna hit us for nine. So we can we still live through two attacks unless we unless we raid when we take one. Really? Probably have to trade off the ruin right away. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, that's not even that good. Well that's that means they can ten yeah, they still can't triple pump next turn. So it's fine. It's just the same. So we draw. That's insane. That's ridiculous. <coughs> so we just. I, I think maybe no attacks. Really? It's the best. Because if you flip something that's one or more, you have to chomp with the black keeper, right? Can I triple? Are you sure we can't triple pump? Can I get the pump this time? It goes to seven. Yep. One, two, three, four. Alright, so you just need that go. That makes sense. Yeah, because otherwise we have to chomp with the Blight Keeper. And then... But we can't... Yeah, this is good. And then next time we don't attack either. Yeah. Wait, no, we do. No, 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 we don't. Because we'll be at one. No, because they just die. Three and four. Yeah, 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 of course, yeah. yeah. I was thinking we chomp and then we attack, but yeah, it's the same. Yeah. Kill them next time. Yeah. They need to remove a counter, I think. Of course, of course, of course. Yeah, they have to draw, they have to draw something. Yeah. I they just draw, like, crappy creatures. All like the removal spell. They have actually quite a few draws, but we have dived down, so yeah. we're just in great shape. Mm. This like was the best play. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Trading Monster Soul probably does it. Yeah. Monster Soul well, Shovel. Maybe not, because dive down adds toughness. I'm definitely not doing the math. <laughs> I'm that. definitely not doing the math on a random Trading Monster Shovel off the top. Exactly, me neither. Well, the old no blocks could get us, but. Nope. <laughs> Go to four. <laughs> okay. Yep. That's what we like to see, Sam. <laughs> yeah. Yay! <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know what they could have. Oh, cannonade. Get a cannonade. <laughs> they can always they have a cannonade. Uh, stinking out on top. <laughs> Ooh, we like to lose dangerously. Maybe attack first. Yeah, maybe I should. Maybe in pop, but yeah. I kind of want to let the trigger resolve first because I just really want to live dangerously, you know. Let the trigger resolve. Flip. Mark of the vampire. Take four. Die. To show him I have no fear. Yeah. <laughs> what? I was like, yeah, what do they have? Alright, they died. Blight, keep it. Kept us alive. So next perfect, we just resubmit, right? Well, yeah. 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 Bit. Maybe you want this. How many flyers are actually in this deck, Sam? Uh, I don't know how we sort it. Uh, that is just three flyers. Not enough. Is enough for a couple of wins? 
Cobbled wings? Question mark? We used the siren cruise on a pounce that game, right? We no, it's used it to. Yeah, when we put the pants on, it pounced. Yeah. Siren yeah, we did. Yeah. Maybe cold wings is better than siren cruise. No, I don't think so. No. It's sugar in our deck. We have like two of these, one of these. You know, helps protect our guys from removal. It just does it all. Okay. I'm just gonna resubmit this. Yeah, I don't know. Can't the creatures. All the spells. Maybe Dark Nourishment. Yep. Maybe we went to cut that. Maybe on the play we want Cobbled Wings and Dark Nourishment out. Yeah, that makes sense. Our opponent's deck seems pretty good. That seems alright. This hand seems alright. Yeah, this is the ready. Pretty the ready good. pirate deck. I like it. The idea of the what do you do on turn two? This or this, you know? Probably the hoarder, right? I think I want to make sure red looter, so I can look away one of his islands. Oh, the, the looter, yeah, yeah, of course. We actually triggered raid. That's great. Boom. Maybe it's correct to discard a 2 2, a 2 1. I think I'm just attacking and making. I, I think I should have just made this guy. I think so. Yeah. I don't know how we can attack and make him discard. Mm. Oh god. Well, he's on to combat. <laughs> down a yields. Slow down there, Sam. Slow down there, Sam. <laughs> did it. He probably just has. They probably just have lands. So I think I'm just a double spell again. This guy. Yeah, that's fine. A few turns away from dying to this, aren't they? <coughs> Alright. They can have the sail back now. Yeah, I think I'm fine with actually just trading off two creatures and dealing them four. If we jam. Pretty bad, right? Yeah, I'm going to attack with this and make this guy. We could jam if they sail back. You could deal unblockable so that we keep that. But yeah. Yeah, playing the extra creature is pretty good, right? I can't wait to be a wind strided. Oh god, wind strider would just be the worst. Me. Oh man. <laughs> so unlucky. Nice, so we uh, make this guy into Rakan. Land. Nice. Could have had skull duggery, but didn't. The worst case. Oh no! Well, this game's gone terribly wrong. I don't think anything with that though, that's alright. Guess we made this creature. Bounce this. Yeah, I like that. It's a really tough game. <laughs> At least we've got a 1 mana 1 1 in play. Exactly. <laughs> no effects. Uh, I don't think I like attacking. I like blocking. I think I'm just gonna let it resolve. Yeah, like surely we can find a nice attack here with the Weaver. Guess not. Ooh, that's pretty horrible. Yeah, I think I just like Weaver, tap this, and tap the ball. Uh, we get in for six. Yeah, and we get a two turn clock. Then we have some outs. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. I like that. If you didn't guess, I'm just playing by smell. We have a bunch of chompers for next turn as well. Weird that they attack me so much. Oh no. That's a really good card. Yeah, we've got a hit. That's an aggressive attack. Just gives me more outs. Yeah, because now you can just leave back all your blockers, get them for three. I guess they don't want to die to an alpha, right? Hmm. Maybe oh not playing God. that one. Sometimes <laughs> if we attack all. Um, nothing good. 
You sure? Did you just have four blockers? You had to kill this. We don't, right? Yeah, right. Because it can block the dead eye tracker. Then it die, right? Four. Oh no. So we're just dead. No. We're fine. We are just dead. We're just dead. So we're just conceding. I think you made them do it. You at least dead eye Tommy to the last card. Yeah. Maybe they won't. Do we have enough mana? 7 8, yeah. Playing so fast in these games. Dormata. Maybe they'll put a creature to grave and we can get him with the explorer. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, they will actually. They will do that. Tackle. Just tackle. Alright. Alright, dead. Alright. What's the thing on, on the. We want this out on the play, this in? Yeah, why not? Yeah, that sounds good. Dark nourishment just. Quite inefficient, right? Yeah. It's just inefficient and the game's not about racing, so the lash doesn't matter that much. Yeah. Yeah, like uh, a. Want that extra ready kit in. Trigger our raid. Yeah. This deck is really sweet. I'd be really sad if we died in round one. Yeah. But it'd definitely be playing tighter, you know. Last and least, then. Last and least. <laughs> this is the way I like to play Magic. I sort of did a great draw last turn. Oh, this would have been an insane draw. Because you're really aggressive and then bink the 2-2. Uh, yeah, that would have been pretty good. I think it's so did hard. You submit? Yeah, yeah, I did. Submit again, just for me, happy Pete. How many drafts do you reckon we'll do for Troll Trader? Like three drafts? Like a little draft primer? Oh, well, his hands are not. Insane. I just want to point out how unlucky we got that we played against. We played around Sale Bank. And he had Windstrider. Yeah. I just want to just point that out. Because yeah. he must have been like, yeah, just get me a Black, just get me a black Keeper. And we're just like, right, well. <laughs> yeah, they must have been there like, don't Alpha. Come on. Don't have Wild Growth Walker. <laughs> That's okay. I'm just going to attack and make the spy. Yeah, the raid card. I wish we had a Rune Raider, that card's great. Yeah. Oh, that's a good draw. It was a good draw. No, no, no third land. Oh, so mm. lucky. So lucky. Okay. I want to just make this, I think. You can make that and the tracker. I don't want to make the tracker. Kind of seems bad. Could be wrong there. You get swamp. Ooh. Definitely topping that. Bruce. Alright, Bruce. not gonna play it because we can Weaver and then we can flick it to Weaver at some other point. Like if we have sail back, we can protect our guy. Oh, that's so aggressive. That? Yeah. What Get is in. that? Get in. Oh, that's, oh, that's pretty good. It's pretty good, actually. I mean, it's actually pretty bad, but. I'm just gonna put this on this guy and get him for eight. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Next time we just have the finishing move. Tap shapes of nature. Sirens ruse. Tap something else. Exactly. Smash. Yep. This is gonna be great. Get aggressive. What? <laughs> what is that? That is that is an aggressive attack. What? Dead. I actually dead. No. You broke my heart. I thought I were actually dead. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, you did. I mean, they're just ridiculously dead, but they're not actually dead. They just died of our flyer, right? Because we want to protect our flyer. Or did flicker. Yeah. I mean, we can't really lose, right? Nine. Even if they have, like, trumpet blast. It's only 15. Draw. Draw a card. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
That's so good. Um, Easy. The Why did he attack so aggressively? Why did they just leave I his back. Understand. It's so I hard to win. Yeah. I think our hand was even that good. Yeah. Well, we got our wish. We got to play next round with this deck. Oh. Also, I'm still just going up in the competitive release. I don't know why. That uh, person was not in our draft. They were definitely not in the draft. This is a keep, I think. Ooh. Just has so high upside. Pretty ugly. It's got a one drop and a pair of pants, though. You can explore, maybe. No. I bet. I bet I get to explore this game. Turn one opt. Turn. <laughs> <laughs> you can't explore turn one, but they still have a time. They're gonna have it. So turn one. Business. Opt. All right, that's a good draw. Yeah, you know, I think I've seen four people crack their clue, crack their um treasure to cast opt. Yeah. Has to be at least four. There's a lot of people. Island. Yeah. Oh, wait. That was just. Just. I don't nice. know who did that one, Sam. Oh, what? <laughs> no. Sam, did you see when my opponent earlier attacked with Fire Shrine Keeper? They flashed that in and tried to block. Wait, really? And it was just it was an, that it was is... an illegal maneuver. <laughs> <laughs> that was my favourite. Do you, I don't know if I told you this, but I have it on my Twitter. It's you just uh illegal maneuvers. Just those illegal maneuvers, you know. There is more illegal maneuvers than you would ever think. Okay. The mirror match. I guess so. That's a good draw. Do I want to win? It's turn. It's kind of risky, isn't it? Yeah. You just make three three and pass. That's what I like more. Yeah. Are you were uh, I was like, you ever played chess, Pete? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've played my fair share of chess. I I recently found out like my play was like I always wanted to trade, like always, like in uh. But the better players don't trade; they just outmaneuver their opponent. Oh, uh, well that's a really good one, isn't it? Guess the ruse goes. Guess the ruse, yeah. It's my favourite card in my hand. Ow. Do we have to make the bat walk the plank? Yeah. No, we just got a rune raider. <sighs> Which is way better. We're gonna, we're gonna draw it anyway. We're just gonna draw nuts. I mean, yeah, I guess we should have looted. We're going to draw Skullduggery, it doesn't matter. We should always loot, right? Well, I, I feel like we should make the bat water plank, you know. If we're going to lose, oh. the one would win anyway. What? No, we he's going to draw a card. Oh, yeah. Goodness, Sam. Um. <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> you should always loot, Sam. Um. <laughs> How would you take two for it? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Look, now, now that Derek Salvatore is tapped, it looks like it's squatting. Yeah, it really does. Amazing. I can't <laughs> believe that. That's so dumb. Oh my god. Oh, it looks like it's squatting. And there are Combo! That's insane. I think we meant to keep the one with a wind. No way. Alright, deal. <laughs> Ow! No way that's correct. Yeah. Sure we should not loot, but we should also hold the island. <laughs> what do you mean, Pete? Always loot. God damn it. I'm so glad it reminded me last turn so I don't keep doing it. Like, I'm so glad it reminded me that turn so it was like a turn where it actually mattered, you know? Like, it was nice enough to me. Ding. Oh, that's just insane. That is just nice, isn't it? It's a nice one. Well, we have three lethal creatures and they have one less blocker. Three lethals. That's so funny. <laughs> God damn it. We wouldn't mind a Raider's Wake in our deck, right? It doesn't seem that bad. Yeah, it doesn't actually seem all that bad on turn four, but I guess when we draw it, it's pretty bad. Yeah, when you flip it off your Rune Raider, you're pretty sad. Yeah. What are they up to here, Sam? They're definitely not dead, because they know about the Skidoggery. They're just definitely dead. <laughs> like, 100%. Why do they make that attack? Like, they have to have something going on. 
they're just they're only out is hoping that we discard this gold bugger. That's a like, pretty wild out. Out. Wang. Bang. I don't know what to do. Just attack with all three right. That is true. Plus one plus one, minus one minus one. There's nothing they could have. Plus one plus one. No. Here? Yep. Wait here. No. Yeah. On the saboteur. I don't know if I have skill doggery, I just lose. No you don't. Oh yeah you do. Yeah, I mean go with your play. If they die here, I mean. Ow! No, they just leave that as block and they survive. They get skull bugger and they just lose. Oh, yeah, I guess so. Wait. Of course they do. No, because then I'm more inclined. Oh, it seems so weird. It's a bad attack, but they were dead either way. Yeah. God damn it. Well, at least we know about Raiders Wake. It's gonna be our third finals in a row. Could it be? That's just insane if it is. Always a, a bride's man, never the bride. You know how it is? Always losing the finals. Classic. I don't think we saw planes last game. We did not. That's a new stretch jump. <laughs> you know that deck's worse by putting the planes in it. What white would you splash? Maybe aerosol? Yeah, aerosol. <laughs> yeah, that too. What? Alright, I really... That cut's pretty good into that. Yeah, I wouldn't splash it though. Do I, I attack? I think I'd splash it. Um, I don't think so. No, I don't think so. I think I'm just so. meant to get going. Uh, yeah. Yeah, because next turn we'll play a creature that holds off their board. Yeah, and they have to use Emrim's Spawn on this. They want to win. Maybe it was a character cast it on this and not attack. Nah, it can't be. Attacking is fine. Blocking is pretty bad against like Zeal and stuff. Oh, they can't be splashing Zeal. Ignore that. They can't be splashing this. That is quite unreasonable. Hold shit. Quite unreasonable. Do you think we make the, the Dark Tormentor here? Yeah. yeah. Wait, no. Wait. Yeah, I like it. Do they take two? No. Scum. Pain costs. <laughs> okay. Why is a card in your deck? <laughs> Pass interdiction. That's how I win. I think I'm just taking this. Yeah, I think that's fine. Oh, we definitely made a free free this turn. Yeah. Nice. They're great. This card's really overperforming. Yeah, it seems decent. Well, at least they can attack, right? Yeah. But now, now we're in this position, like, every draw... The yeah, the red wake now looks terrible. Well, it did deal us six. It can deal us eight. It can deal us eight damage. I think it's a lot of damage. Alright, <laughs> okay. uh, he's just trying to trigger it. Yeah, of course. Okay, they have to trigger it there. Yeah, I think so too. Where because we collect Dark Nourishment, every drawer is great. That is lovely. I mean, we definitely still cast it. No, you just attack with all. Yeah, I like attack with all. Attack all. And he has to trade. Nice. Do that one is actually just super dead. Do we, do we cast it? Definitely. I guess it is an upgrade. It's a huge upgrade. On our, on our free free. We also get a blocker. 
That's the only draw I deck that makes me less take yeah, two. Yeah, literally the only draw. Apart from like, yeah, because we don't have five drops. Yeah, we, we don't can't have five drops. Well, we can just draw lands or or spells there. Yeah. Okay. I even said it as well, preemptively. Okay. Well. Maybe we'll wait in this one though. Maybe you meant to board card in against dinosaurs. Maybe. It looked pretty decent here and it's not the matchup for it, right? Yeah. It's just not some turn four, I think. On the play as well, it seems yeah. the same. Because your opponent, like, like he played a lot of crap cards. And also, your opponent has more cards on the draw. Yeah. So it's like doubly good. He played a lot of crap cards though, and then the game still felt close. Yeah. It's just because of this. Well, it wasn't close, but... Well, there were finals. Third finals in a row. Crazy. Crazy no game. wins though. I, I think I played five drafts a day. Won one, finals three, lost round one of one. The, no, round two of one. The now one. Pretty great. I Pretty just can't believe Amaz has played 26 drops, let alone won 26 drops. Really? True story. Beat him on my way to winning an online PTQ. Play him in draft format. Oh. It was sealed. It was like, uh, maybe M14 sealed or something, M15 sealed. Ages ago. I uh, he Ooh. might. 77. It's a bit of a warrior. I don't know how you get the avatar. Yeah, where do you get that avatar from? Where do you get that? Party from. I love that song. I mean business. Yeah. With this sort of hand, you just need to find one with a win, so I figured it's best of all. Good start, Sam. Exactly, see? Now we draw Ruin Raider, the game's over. Now our opponent doesn't play a 2 or 3 drop, and they can't win. We draw 3. God damn it. God damn. I guess we have to hold it. Yeah. Just get some more damage that way. Especially if they play like a 2 3. Yeah. That would look really silly. Oh, yes. That's great. Yeah. The problem with this deck is it's pretty hard to get la through the last few points of damage I found. Dude, we got Blight Keepers on lockdown. Oh. oh crap. That is not a good one to have. Oh my god. You just jam. Yeah. That was a really good draw. We just jam, dude. They could have. Boon. Boon. I think I'm happy to trade Boon. That's not good for us, right? He's paying cost. Is that like a bounce spell? Oh, no, they're trying to block. They tried to block and he clicked this. That's. Hopefully, yeah. Yeah. Damn. What? Depths. Oh, that's like the best thing they could have for us. I was thinking about letting it not let it resolve, but because we can double spell anyway. I think it just. It just I made a misplay. What? What? Oh. Why? Are you like what? I thought you were gonna play the two drop. I am. Oh, you can play both. Yeah, so I didn't. Oh, that's great. That was my mistake. So now I know I have an island in hand. It wouldn't have known. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. It doesn't matter that much, but it was loose play. It's bad sequencing on my part. Six, six. That's okay. Yeah. That is okay. Boom. I think I'm gonna hold it. Tap for two this turn. Yeah, I can respect that. Because you probably just have a land in hand. Illegal maneuver, friend. <laughs> I think about, you know, responding and be like, yeah, yeah, it's a bit of a. I should have put it on Twitter, you know. You hold the tormentor. Yeah, 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 because they just have lands in hand. I might just make double spells this turn. I'll get that last card. Well. And that's exactly what happened. That's a pretty bad attack, I think. Yeah, that's kind of loose. Yeah. Kind of loose. Yeah. You don't want to tap for 2 4? 
Nah, that's what attack this turn. I think that's just better spots for it, you know. Yeah, okay. Seven drop. Seven drop. Damn. <laughs> Flag. The draw seven. What did you draw? That's a good one. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's gonna be a hard one to beat, I think. Maybe the trade dive down for the prosperous pick up, not like us. Okay. <laughs> Spoke too soon. Guess we're casting it. Yeah, it's got a have no attacks and no box, so uh, your turn. Come on, man. Cast into cast, it's pretty unreasonable. Come on, man. Yeah, that's basically how we lost this game. Never lost yet, but most likely losing. I kind of wish we drew that, um, that Dark Nourishment, to be fair. It'd still be good. Yeah, it's on bottom of our deck, though. Uh, yeah. I'll trade Dive Down. Wait, should we even show him Dive Down? It's pretty loose, right? Do you have anything that kills the fly? Well, I just have this, and we could draw Mark of the Vampire. It's not super loose to show Dive Down. I think it might be. I just don't think it. It's not a good trade, right? No, it's rather just trade the creatures. Yeah, I think so. I think Dadan's worth more. We draw Market of Vampire and we just get going on this guy. Yeah, exactly. Alright, yeah. so I'll be held lands. Um. Oh, I want to tap this. That's fine, right? Yeah, but then I just take four. What? When I just take four. I just die next turn, I have to find something. Yeah, that's true. Otherwise you're trump attacking a dead eye torment though. Yeah, I think I just gotta I think I gotta do this and just find Market of Vampire. Yeah. Sooner than later. I'll just let the flying enchantment. Just give flight. Yeah. I'd happily meant to trade. It's yeah. just great. Just simplifying the board here. Yeah, exactly. You know, you know what I'm about. Well, those aren't the best rules. Mm. They bottomed. Nice. Oh boy. That's not too bad. Can still draw market a vampire. Or one with a wind. Yep, would be decent. Yeah. Yep. Do we have any outs? <laughs> Nope. Guess we're dead. Alright, against my folks. What do we like? Absolutely goldlings. What do I dislike? None of my cards. <laughs> well, guess we're running it back. I guess this card's not great. But he had the whip tail actually, so I don't want cobbled wings. Yeah, it's fair. It's probably fine. Maybe we'll actually we want this, right? Maybe. Oh, the Raiders wake. Yeah, okay. We're getting involved. It looks so good in the last round. I'm just like, yeah, it's it good. Looks super good. Yeah. Maybe maybe this is just the future, and that guy's nailed it. I think Raiders wake could be decent, especially when your opponent just starts looting. Yeah. Yeah, that is right. Against the draw seven, you know, if they draw seven, you keep getting a deal them too. Pretty great. Draw seven, just have to like discard loads to hand size. Yeah, exactly. Did I tell you um I played against Quan Man in the PTQ in the weekend and I was really ahead on board. And then uh I managed to did I navigate like did I his last card and then he untaps and draws his draw seven. It's like <sighs> womp womp. Sounds great. How's this? <laughs> First I shoot it up on top, it's nuts. Uh, yeah. I just have a feeling it's going to be right there. Or a one drop. Like one of the flies would just be. What? Well. Oh, that's the one. That's the ticket. It's not the right one drop, but as long as 
the time it breaks on the two drop. Oh, well, I have to. They played this. They can't have two. Two early spells. Those were some. Yes. Oh, yes. It's over. Like this. It's kind of good. Ah, so it's not when you get targeted. Oh, that would be really good against this week. But like, from Water Trap Weaver, it gets trigger. That's it, right? That's it. It's just really bad against me, I think. Yeah. Seems kind of bad. Brick. Yes. Oh, yes. We have to just so make. We have to make the the wake, right? I think so. It's just so good. Wait, I don't know how it works. Can you play it main phase too? Yes. Ah, okay. <laughs> Ding. Gotcha. Gotcha, pod. Well. Oh, what? No. no. <laughs> that is just ridiculous. I'm sorry, bad. bud. <laughs> now Market of Amber becomes way better. That is ridiculous. Yep. Sure, Paul. Sure. Sure. Paul. Paul. Pathetic guard, Yugi. Do you want to hit a death of his eye? My one drop. Pepperidge Farm remembers. That was great. We had to explore with this guy now for the first time. Yeah, that's pretty gas. I think it's gonna matter. The Raiders wake, feeding the dead tracker. Let's see, it's just like we drew it up. Draw seven. No way. Get draw seven. Out of. <gasps> that's kind of like a draw seven. It costs seven and it draws cards. <laughs> Yep, you're right. I think it's just gonna die eventually. <laughs> it's just gonna die, isn't it? Um, oh, this is fucking funny. <laughs> He's gonna block and then yeah. trigger! <laughs> God. Say goodbye. <laughs> this card's been great. This one's pretty good. It's dealt six. And, and killed it. <laughs> because we combat it with the Storm Sculpt Turret. And it also killed Tashana. But if you just had like the 1 1 flight, if that 1 drop was the 1 1 flight, it would have triggered every single time. Yeah. Instead of like, we missed a turn. Maybe there's a deck that just wants to play that and. I don't believe it. <laughs> well, they must have seen the pants, so... They didn't. They did, right? No, we didn't draw any of them. What? It's just assuming. That was not reasonable. Target your own cart. Target your graveyard, please. No, that would be insane. No, there's no way they do that. No, no way there. that happens. Oh, god damn it. Are you attacking? Alright, your Tashana can die. And your Tashana's Wayfinder. Oh, there it is! I snapped on that one because it actually just, like, just kills him. Yeah. I think we're meant to market a vampire this turn and get in. Well, I don't think we need to. It gives, it gives us lethal next turn. You have lethal anyway. No, no, because no, they're going to get 2 to go 11, so. No? But then they're at 5. Okay, it's true. Oh no. What? Okay, okay. Sam? Oh, 
Okay. Got no cars in hand. Well, you gotta cast them. You jam and play it. I really do. Yeah. This feels great, right? Can we just? Can we remember how good this card was, please? Can we talk about it? Nah, I don't think your opponent wants to talk about it. Okay. Nice draw. Double deadsies. Yeah. Nice slicing, Twain. <laughs> that was. And spell pierce was nice too. I spell pierce. We boarded your ass. Sorry, folks. Deck is horrible. We can't lose. It's good. Can we board your ass, please? No. And Blight Keeper. Doesn't, the rest doesn't hit anything. The cards it hits are just not playable cards. It hits Slice and Dwayne. That's not a good card. Do we board in a third Blight Keeper? Maybe. With the Raider's Wake synergy. We were just, nah, we shouldn't do that. We're reading too much into it. We'll run it back. Set up onto all the Slice and Dwayne's. We're like an idiot. Have to keep this. We can't mull. You have creature from hand. Any mulls? Obviously keep it. Back. And this is a nice... There's a Raider's Wake on top, I can feel it. Raider's Wake. Well, yeah. we do have two drop as well, that'll be nice. Yeah, but that's gonna come on turn three. Oh, that, that will get scored up right if I draw. That might be the worst draw in our deck. What do you think the, the better draw is? Two drop. Two drop. That's good. But do you think this is the worst card in the deck? Like the worst card we could have drawn? Um, Swamp might be worst. It's close. This guy's Thanks going to make a pump the jungle delver. Nah, we're gonna make a four drop. What do we need to name? My folks? Dinosaur. Dinosaur? Oh no. <laughs> weren't they splashing white? Ah, oh, we're making the whip tail. No, we weren't making splashing. That was the last point. Splashing okay. white. It's a whippy tail, huh? He comes equipped for a job. Come on, Sam. Oh man, this card is great. Well, dude, you can just put both pants on and just go to town. <laughs> I'm just wearing many pants. Mm -hmm. We could have a bounce spell though. Probably have a bounce spell. We might just have to do it though. What is this little number? Depths. Dinosaur? What dinosaur do I have? Have a whip tail? Oh, nearly. <laughs> Maybe he's got to get involved. Please. Just double block. Maybe we should have used it there. No, I think it's fine. Really? What if oh, they just like, go for a pump? What if they have Savage Stomp? Yeah, exactly. What if they just have Slice and Twain? I'm going to do it now. <laughs> Kill guy before we draw. They can't hit River Hell's Moon. Yeah, I guess he can't hit it anyway. It's been a pretty hard game to win now. <laughs> yeah, well, not really. We have the unblockable dude. And they just have no attacks. Yeah. I think we bounce this guy, right? Uh, yeah. It's great value. Great value. Yeah, exactly. I don't know, I think we're pretty ahead, dude. Well, if they attack there, I don't know if we're winning. If they attack, yeah, we're not <laughs> Yeah, I don't know how we... I shouldn't have it quantified that in their brain. Yeah, I'm not really sure. They have to have Tishana. Six damage for two. They can have Tishana and they're like, yeah. well, I don't want to trade. I don't like, like race. If the game goes long, we just draw three or something. Yeah, I must be all the way through there. Something like that. Okay. I don't get it. <laughs> yeah. Well... <laughs> Putting on the pants, we've been going. We can make, yeah, we can make that first. Yeah, I agree. <coughs> Alright, now we're doing it. Alright, you agree? 
It's okay, yeah. You can always give the menace guy flying and plus two this next turn. But I think we just need to start racing. Because we've got hands, it's like basically nothing. But it, it hits for a lot. A lot more. Right? No. Kills him in one, two, three hits. This kills him in like four hits. True Tishana. It's pretty hard to beat. That is pretty also, hard. they can block the menace guy. Yep. For some reason. They've got a sand as well. Come on. Okay. Come on. That's not a reasonable, not a reasonable effect. No, it's not is it? We could, oh, Raider's Weight would be the Nuts. That's kind of good. Everyone gets it now, right? Mm. They're gonna block everything. Maybe just this guy. Yeah. That makes sense. This is better. Agreed. Tishana? Oh, yes. I don't know if our opponent could have played any worse. <laughs> it really was interesting. It was pretty bad. I think I just had like cats I, I mean, obviously we know the cards that we play. We but play around 12 pills, yeah. It was kind of bad. Yeah. It, it was, was just, it was also kind of a bait because in the first games, <laughs> we had like Water Trap Weaver and stuff and like the Mark of the Vampire. That yeah. made racing like really impossible for them. So they were like, well, just going to hold back, try and play the value game. And then this game had something they just couldn't invent with. Yeah. So it was kind of, kind of a good spot. Well, this game still might be close. I didn't want like out of the woods yet, you know. I think it's kind of over. If he just attacks an apprentice, I think we're very ahead. Um, God damn it! <laughs> Come on, man. What do I want to draw? Red is white. I just always wanted to draw that card. It's my favorite card. Okay. I'm not <laughs> sure about that one. <laughs> I think that could have come down before attack. <laughs> God damn. Okay. Bye. I'm all in. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. I'm still. <laughs> diggity diggity dive time. <laughs> I'm still all in. <laughs> so take eight. <laughs> they have something to remove a blocker. Which is dead. We could, yeah, but they're dead today anyway. Cause they could just kill our storm sculptor, right? Lands and creatures we can beat. Lands and creatures. Lands and creatures and slice and twains and shapers. And we can beat those. Yeah, <laughs> and we can't. Oh, oh five. Oh, we could beat that. Do you like that they tap their mana thing? <laughs> <laughs> That's impressive. Oh my god. That is this is just this smells like a death for extra attack, does it? I'm just gonna bottle like this. No, come on, Sam, you gotta bottle the two two with it. <laughs> no, don't how do I lose? What? How do I wait, I take nine, get a one? I'm not dead, right? I take nine, get a one. Am I missing something? I'm not right. I don't think so. I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> he was like, right, it was a close game. <laughs> if they bounced to 5 4 now, <laughs> I, would just, I would cry. I would actually cry. <laughs> we won a draft. Oh, wow. That was a sick dick. <sighs> that dick was sweet. Yeah, we learned that uh, Raiders Wake Red's better than we thought. Good, yeah. yeah, amazing. And I've I got. Seen that card before. I, I thought it was decent, but. It just it looks really looks bad, like right? It's insane there, but it's not, it's not that good. Like, it's probably, like, fine playable. Yeah. In these kind of days. Maybe it's just nuts. It's just another thing that helps the one drops, right? It's definitely gonna be nuts and sealed, right? Mm. Mm. No. Mm. Why not? Because it's pretty good when you've got all these crappy, like, one drops and stuff. Yeah, just put this card in the deck and seal. Well. <laughs> good point. Worse than sealed. I don't know, I've had a lot of black keeps and sealed. But, uh, anyway, uh, I guess, um,. We were We're good, yeah. <laughs> you don't remember? <laughs> I guess, uh, well, thanks for watching. I think we're going to another draft and probably record it too. We'll see. Yeah. Well, that was interesting. I can't we won that draft. Too. Yeah, me neither. I just, we're just going to draft till Greg's open, so. Yeah. Probably another draft. Well, thanks for watching and we'll see you at the next one. Thank you.
Bye. Should we say peace? Should we, should we finish off with peace? Peace.